And a state auditor will brief the FBI on the state's largest public embezzlement scheme in Mississippi's history. The auditor's office arrested six people last week in connection with the multi-million dollar embezzlement scheme. Now, two of those people are John Davis, the former director of the Mississippi Department of Human Services, and Nancy New, owner and director of the Mississippi Community Education Center and New Learning Incorporated. Now, the six are accused of transferring millions in TANF funds meant for the needy to their private businesses. Some of it paid for the luxury drug rehabilitation program for a former pro wrestler, Brett DiBiase. Auditor White said that more than $4 million was taken from Mississippi taxpayers. And Auditor White said that he will give all of the evidence his office gathered to the FBI. He's also calling on the legislature for a full forensic audit of the state welfare agency.